Yeah, like, see, there's no way that doesn't go in. Nothing pisses me off more in this game than missing threes when I know they should go in. If I mess up the shot, fine. That's fair. When I know the release is perfect and they still... It still somehow doesn't go in and I have the badges that should let it go in. It doesn't make sense to me. But that's just how the game is built. That's how they make the difficulties. That's how they make the animations. It's meant to screw you over. Since you have to play my career to grind badges and all that. They're going to make it difficult. And they're going to make the CPU or the AI screw you over on purpose. So you don't get that. And it's sad because look. I can get right by all these defenders. I can clearly blow by anyone. They haven't fixed that since 2K like 17. But they screw up the shooting which was honestly fine. For offline play at least. I don't know about online. I don't care about online. But offline, my career wise, the shooting was fine. There was nothing wrong with it. Alright, we have made it. The 2020, I think 4. If I'm not mistaken. Yes, the 2024. NBA playoffs, we are going up against the Orlando Magic in round one, and I only plan on probably playing or recording one of these games because it's round one, it's the Magic, it shouldn't be that interesting. Uh, they got Kyrie Irving, Franz Wagner, Paolo Bancaro, Vucevic is back, Wendell Carter, they have a good bench, it's a good team, but I mean, I don't expect them to give us much of a challenge. It's round two that I'm expecting to be a good one against the Boston Celtics if they can survive the Toronto Raptors. And I just realized, do they have an injury? Or no, they're just starting Peyton Pritchard over Marcus Smart and Bro Brogdon. I did get the NBA Triple Crown. 37 points led the league. 15 assists led the league. And I got 2.4 steals, which also led the league. The first ever, I don't think it's first ever, but I'll just say it. First ever NBA Triple Crown. I shot 66% from the field and for players who qualified i believe that is what fourth led the league in three point percentage seth curry my teammate was right behind me uh fifth in the league in three pointers made 30th in attempted so that just says a lot right there uh free throw percentage led the league uh free throws 15 attempted film 20th uh points allowed i allowed the most points but uh players attempt the most field goals on me by three but with that being said let's jump into this game Alrighty, game one start of the NBA playoffs. My first playoff run with my new team, the Miami Heat. Yurtsevin wins the tip, and we are off. Going against Kyrie Irving in the Orlando Magic. One seed, eight seed battle for Florida in round one. Let's see if we can win that battle. Omer Yurtsevin straight to the paint. He's not going to do much in there. Oh, Kyrie jumped on that. I did not expect that. I'm going to go for the, in the paint, and it's a foul immediately. Yikes, that, was, that should have been a flagrant. Oh, uh, four to four start so far. Let's see what the Kyrie Irving and the Orlando Magic offense is all about. They do got scoring. Kyrie, Franz Wagner, Paolo. They they definitely got scoring. What they don't have is much defense. This starting lineup is poor at defense looking at it on paper. It's so bad. Vucevic gets that layup to go, but I can tell right now that this is going to be a just full scoring offense. That seems like what this team is uh, planned to be. It's just straight offense as Oladipo gets it started with a dunk. But yeah, I'm, it looks like they just want to score 130 points a game and give up about 120. On um, fast break, bam, full court. That should be an easy dunk. 8-6 to six lead so far. Johnson's got, I believe, 6 points in the game with that dunk. Yeah, like see, there's no way that doesn't go in. But that does. That I, I essentially took the same exact shot as Franz Wagner. And his goes in. Mine's contested. And the, the shot was off, which it clearly wasn't. We're down by the six as Franz Wagner decided he wanted to become uh, Kevin Durant in his prime. Doesn't make sense. Jimmy Butler, please catch this lob. What was... Bro, Fra why is Franz Wagner playing like KD and Michael Jordan combined into one? Like, what is that? I do, what, how? I don't understand it. Doesn't make any sense. Move back to me. Like, my God, how is that a turnover? I basically lobbed it right into Jimmy's hands, and they take the ball away. This team's got Spencer Dinwiddie, too. Why do they have so many point guards? Like, they're running RJ Hampton at small forward because they have so many. What? What? 2K. Your game just makes no sense to me. 
I'm getting subbed out. We had such a poor start. I'm one for five from three. One of those three should have went in. That You saw that. That was legit complete bogus from 2K. And we're down by probably five because I would never have expected Franz Wagner to be balling out like this. Does, does not make much sense to me. I've got Kyrie on locks. He is not a problem right now. But it's everyone else. Victor, can you please leave me alone? It's everyone else, mainly Franz Wagner on the team, that is just killing us on the offensive end. It doesn't make much sense to me how Jimmy Butler is not able to... I know Franz is really good, but he ain't 10 points in 2 minutes type good. And Jimmy Butler can't hold his own against him. There's no reason why it should be a 2-point game, but I'll, I'll take the actual competition. I didn't expect the 8 seed to give us trouble like this. But when 2K has you shooting like you're a prime Andre Roberson... I guess that's what happens. I already have 28 points in 12 minutes of action here. 28 points. We're up by 6. Kyrie still can't buy a shot. Vucevic with the ball. I was trying to steal it. I'm hungry for steals. I ain't got no steals in this game. Old Depot on Jalen Suggs. Kyrie's going to probably try and get open. Or did they give up on the Kyrie experiment? Nope, they did not. Kyrie Irving, terrible shot once again. Give me my 5th rebound of the game. And let's see if I can get an assist here. No? All right. I'll gladly take the 30-point first half. We are playing smothering defense right now. That was a bad pass. That was a really bad pass on my... I did not even see Franz there. But we are playing smothering defense so far in this game. It's The Magic can't even score right now. They got Paolo on... Like, we're double-teaming shots. I mean, Bam probably shouldn't have double-teamed off of Vucevic. But, like, for, from... Uh, I'll up until then, the double teams are working. So, I mean, I will definitely take it. I hate that they pass it back so instantly. Like, they don't give me time to do anything off ball. Like that. Like, I let me give me time to get open. Jimmy Butler, you have a clear lane to the basket, and he hits an eight-point lead. All right, I'm going to sub that. We have an eight-point lead. Let's see what our bench can do. I don't know how that we just scored... I, I don't even know. I don't know how we just scored 13 points in two minutes, but we did, and we now have a 19-point lead. Well, this went from a competitive game to a blowout, thanks to our bench. I I guess that just showed that I won the MVP. Thanks, uh, 2K, for that. Uh, yeah, th this was literally a competitive game. Then our bench decided, you know what, we're going to score 13 points in uh, two minutes. Uh, yeah, I don't know who did it. I don't know who was on the court to do that, but okay then. Now this is all of a sudden a blowout. Kyrie Irving just hit his first shot of the game. He's 1 for 10. Until that point, which he got off a fast break, so I couldn't even really guard him. He had not even made a shot. He was 0 for 9. That is bad, bro. That is awful. And I was considered one of the worst defenders in the league. I bet. Say less. Oh, my God. Your is having himself a day. He's got 11 points, 10 rebounds, and a block on perfect shooting. Have yourself a day, Yurt. That should have been my steal, though, if you could have grabbed it. Yurt's in. Keep playing that defense. I'm Vucevic. Amazing. Yurt is having himself a day. Yurt's a win to me. Oh, that's a foul. Give me that. There's my first steal. Bam. Keep running the floor, Bam. Please score this bucket. And he does with ease. And we now have a 29-point lead. And they've scored a total of nine points since uh, the last time I was on the court, which was two minutes left in the second. Ooh, I, that, I thought I got that steal. Yeah, they, they have not done so well. I call this a good offensive team, but... Oh, Jimmy Butler with the defense! Oh, Adipo, he's going to go straight to the paint and brick it as I expected, but I was getting molested in the paint by Franz Wagner. Oh, Big Yurt back in the post. Big Yurt got bodied. Okay, maybe maybe that was not going to go as well as I thought it was going to, but let's let's get Big Yurt some points. Let's see if we can get Big Yurt some buckets. Yurtsevin in the paint. He missed. He gets the rebound. Back out to me. It bricked because I mistimed my shot by 0 0.2 milliseconds. I'm getting subbed out as I keep missing threes. And honestly, nothing pisses me off more in this game than missing threes when I know they should go in. If I mess up the shot, fine. That's fair. When I know the release is perfect and they still... It still somehow doesn't go in, and I have the badges that should let it go in. It doesn't make sense to me, but that's just how the game is built. That's how they make the difficulties. That's how they make the animations. It's meant to screw you over. They're just going to do it. It happens all the time. It's happened for years. And it's sad because, look, I can get right by all these defenders. 
I can clearly blow by anyone. They haven't fixed that since 2K like 17. But they screw up the shooting, which was honestly fine. For offline play at least. I don't know about online. I don't care about online. But offline, my career wise, the shooting was fine. There was nothing wrong with it. And they still changed it. And right here, if Bam doesn't sell this play, which he does, and I can cap off this blowout win with a triple-double, my first playoff triple-double of my career. Bam's got 12. We're up by 50. I have a 44-point triple-double. I think it's fair to say we can close this one out as Bam gets a goal 10 somehow. That looked like a block. And with that, the uh, Magic decided they wanted to try and score. Uh, yeah, you, you don't do that against me. Now now I'm going to score on you. You don't try and score when the game's over. Nah, nah, nah. If you're going to do that, I'm going to do it too. And we're going to win 78 to 133. That is a 55-point victory. That is insane. We won by more points than I scored. And I scored 50. That just goes to show you all of a man. Final box score, 52 points, 10 rebounds, 11 assists, and 2 steals. Uh, I did have 7 turnovers. I couldn't stop turning the ball over. 3 for 11 from 3. I, I have no answers there. Uh, Seth Curry was the person who gave us that big lead off the bench is what I'm assuming. If we Let's let's go to the second court. You no, know, he only gave us 4. Who gave us, who gave us that lead? I guess it was a mix, to be honest. Because Seth Curry, I don't know where he came from. He had 12 points in the second half. Uh, Yurt's been at 13 and 13. It wasn't even Bam had 12 and 16. Jimmy Butler only had four shot attempts and he shot it six times. So it wasn't even Jimmy Butler that needed to do anything. Seth Curry out of nowhere. Yurt's been out of nowhere. Alex Lynn, I already praised him before the game. And for the Magic, Franz Wagner, 17 points, 5 for 10. Uh, Vucevic had 16 points. Dinwiddie had 12. Kyrie Irving, I put him in absolute hell. Nine points on three for 19 shooting, one for seven. I think he hit two shots on me this entire game. Two shots, two out of his three shots. He was 0 for 9 to start the game against me. I, I think I'm a pretty decent defender nowadays. But that's going to be for me. I'll see you in round two because I'm not recording or uploading any more of this round. GG.